Welcome to Goalie's PIP Academy. Hey there, brain-tickling electromagnets. Today, we're diving headfirst into the world of magnets. Buckle up, it's going to be a wildly attractive adventure. Magnets, in case you've been living under a rock, that's probably not magnetic, are usually made of iron or steel and possess this superpower called magnetism. This essentially means they can attract certain types of metals. These metals stick to the magnet like cookie crumbs stick to a fresh shirt. Trust me, we've all been there. Here's your first pop quiz. Are you ready? Can you tell me what are magnets made up of? A. Iron or steel. B. Rubber or plastic. Yes, you're right. Magnets are made up of iron or steel. Very well done, champs. Now, every magnet runs on the buddy system, boasting two distinct ends. Hello North Pole and South Pole. Think of it as being at a dance party. The North and South Poles are drawn to each other and want to dance together forever because they attract each other. But put two Norths or two Souths together? Not gonna happen. It's like they each ate heaps of garlic bread before the party. They repel each other. All right, geniuses, quiz time. Guess what two North Poles do when they encounter each other? A. They attract each other. B. They repel each other. If you guess they repel each other, then congrats! You've got it! Magnets come in three fabulous variations. Temporary magnets, permanent magnets, and electromagnets. Temporary magnets are like that friend who only calls you when they need something. They magnetize when a magnetic field is present, but lose their charm when it disappears. Permanent magnets are more loyal, and they've had their magnetic field from birth, like the ones holding your mom's shopping list hostage on the fridge. While electromagnets are the tech wizards of the gang, who only throw their magnetic field when an electrical current powers them up. Here's the real kicker, though. Our good old planet Earth has its own magnetic field, courtesy of its iron and nickel core. It's like Earth's own magnetic charm. Back to the drawing board. Quiz time again. How many types of magnets are there? A, 1, B, 3, C, 5, D, 4. There are total three types of magnets. You guessed it right. Well done. We've been through quite a ride, haven't we? From figuring out that magnetism is more than just social charm to uncovering the dramatics of the North and South Poles. We even discovered the Earth's magnetic personality. Now, if that isn't magnetic field day, before we go, here's a joke for you. Why don't magnets ever go on dates? Because they always find someone too attractive. Ha, ah, gotcha. I hope I've managed to stick some magnetic knowledge on the fridge of your mind. This is another video brought to you by Goalie, the best kids tablet. My mind is blown. Where can I learn more about these videos? Oh yeah, getgoalie.com. There's no ads, there's no junk, just cool stuff for kids and a dedicated tablet. Check it out, getgoalie.com.